Okay, now we can keep going. So, and before I, I, I create the rooms, uh, I forget to start, you know, with the introduction about how TNT works. That's the important one uh, thing to do. So uh, TNT, we are a community where we came here to communicate in foreign languages, right? Not just English. There are also Spanish, Italian, and French, if I am correct. Uh, the live meetings are not regular classes. I'm not a teacher. I'm not here to correct anyone. There's no material or homework. We're here, you know, just to meet different people, have a nice chat, and get to know each other. Uh, practice our, our speaking in order to build confidence and achieve fluency, right? That's the main point here. But if you are interested to see, uh, to have classes, you know, you can check all the available options in our website, right? And I believe that's all. So I will create a, a room, guys, and I bring you guys back around 9.50, okay? Have a great conversation. Oh, let me just paste again the questions for Victoria. There you are. So bye-bye. See you guys All right in around 45 minutes. Okay. If you don't receive any invitation, it means you gotta stay here with me. in the main room. Yes. So, let me see. Yes, yes, yes. So here with me, we have Rafael, Mariana, Marcio, and Julia. Hi there. So, we just watched a video right? A parody of a song uh, talking about being techy. But first of all, maybe we could start presenting ourselves and maybe as, uh, answering question number one as well. Maybe, let me see. Mariana, could you start? Yes, my name is Mariana. Uh... I'm from Brazil, but in this moment, I live in Czech Republic. I am uh, 28 years old. I'm married. I don't have children. And I just have a dog. And sometimes I work like babysitter. Uh, about the question number one, is this difficult? Uh, tracky. Tracky is may it's uh, brega in Portuguese. Okay, so I understand correctly. I thought uh, the trachy is, uh, I don't know, uh, the lake uh, of the good taste, maybe in some cases, but it's re relative because something is okay for me, but for the others, no. Uh, it's difficult to say, but... Uh, I thought that that is. Yes, yes, you know that girl. That's it. So yeah, that's why I I said that it it would be like a little bit polemic and sensitive topic maybe because just like you mentioned, it's a kind of depends of the person's perspective, right? So what is tacky for me? Maybe it's not tacky for the others. Uh, let me see. Uh, um, Rafael, and you, can you present yourself? Answer. <laughs> Sorry, uh, my name is Rafael Martins. I have the 34 years old. I live in São Gonçalo, Rio de Janeiro. And about the questions, is uh, like Mariana said, uh, uh, people without your, uh, oh, they have uh, your only fashion concept is different in society and nomadic society. I said in, uh, with my my boy, my kids, my family, 
Okay, without is not follow the rules of society is different. Is different is is not a good thing in in more the more the thing. Uh, most of this case, this case, okay. And uh, when uh, you for you for you talk about tracking, I remember Falcon. You know Falcon is. I know. Sir. I just <laughs> this means uh thing of tracking <laughs> in Brazil. <laughs> Yes, yes, Falcon is a good example. I when I was watching, I, re, I was like thinking all the time, uh, seeing their clothes on Augustinho Carrara as well. <laughs> right? Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> all the time. Family, right? Yes. Uh, grande família, right? So, <laughs> yeah, Rafael mentioned something really interesting about you know, like being an, an expression that he is uh, being different, right? That's a, 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 a way to, to explain what techie means. Yeah, it's different from the, the regular ones, right? Some people that, uh, you know, have a different taste for the things. Thanks, uh, Rafael. Let's hear now from, let me see, Julia. And you, can you present yourself in answering question number one? Yes, yeah, sure. My name is Julia. I am 17 years old. I born in Osasco, with a city of Sao Paulo. And I have many hobbies, like I like to dance, to reading, to watch TV. And the, about the first question, my opinion is very difficult to see why it's track because uh, we we tracks for me is not for another. But I think he, when you uh, use it, some some things is a track is when you dress. Uh, one thing is outside the society is trenders uh, because in your society uh, who uh, who look for these parties is people who work in fashion industries and the, I think these people uh, talk about all people uh, who is beautiful or not and the the all people uh, in the world uh, use it the the clothes who uh, agree or don't agree fashion people. Yes, yes. Uh, so welcome. So you have seventeen. Maybe you are the youngest person in that have ever came to to my meetings. Welcome, Julia. Uh, it's a pleasure. So, yeah, you mentioned something really interesting about uh, fashion industry, the trends, right? There are some trends that I look at and I say, oh, it, that's a, <laughs> a little bit tacky. Uh, I will not, would not use it, right? Uh, but yeah, you are correct that uh, it's tough to, to you know, to define because it depends on each person, right? So at least, but not last, uh, Marcio, your turn. Hello, everyone. I'm Marcio. I live in Guarulhos, São Paulo, near of the airport. I am 53 years old. I work with the IT. And about the first question, um, so uh, the first thing I saw was about uh, the, the clothes, because for me, when the extravagant somebody could be here, but I believe that the next step after the extravagant is tax. <laughs> I. I my definition about the tech may be that so is for Marcio is uh, uh, the next level of being extravagant 
right? Exactly. Got it. So yeah, I think that they are uh, intimately re related, <laughs> maybe. Uh, so let me just present myself real, really quick, quickly for those who doesn't know me. I am Ana Laura, I'm 26, I live in Barueri, Sao Paulo, here from Julia, in Osasco. So uh, let me see what else. I work with quality control in the food industry. I live with my boyfriend uh, on my free time. I like to read books, uh, do some biking, watch movies. That's pretty much me. And uh, for me, I would say techie, it's like eccentric, like different from the others, like, you know, it's not uh, something unusual, a person that have unusual, but uh, a, a, an unusual taste for, you know, things and behaviors like the, the song mentioned, right? But let's discuss uh, this later. Maybe we can move to question number two. Rafael, could you read us out loud? And start. In one minute. One minute. Can you think of any examples of think behavior or fashion choice you haven't seen recently? Uh, I start. Yes, please. Okay. Did you? I don't know is a uh, thinky, but uh, in Rio, I don't, I don't know if you are all state, you know. I do Muay Thai, is, uh, have a, a lot of teenagers yeah, do the sports, and they have a behavior to say, in Rio, they call Korea, the they teenagers put the take photos without a hand in the face, you know, like this. <laughs> For me, so it's strange. I don't know if you only read you or in Sao Paulo too. I don't know. But it's a behavior different. I say it's I I look uh, I look uh, up teenagers. I I have I I think it's so funny, but it's a behavior complete. Let me see if I, yeah. I I got it. Um they take photos of just their hands that that's it, so? Yes. Yeah, oh. put your hand in the face, so like this. Oh, like in the face. Oh, like this. Yes. Oh, <laughs> it's, it's that they are, cause, because uh, it's because they are like shy <laughs> to, to show their faces. I don't know, but that's, this is a little bit awkward. <laughs> strange <laughs> for me as well so don't take it if you... uh, they use, uh, the boys have a user uh, i don't know it's the minute of my life but um you can't even have to call up my sister but it's my carter i don't know what's that i don't know yes 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 <laughs> I joke with my boys, uh, things of Korea, some of the Korea, some people who live in the same place, I don't know. Sinceramente, I'm still here, but I'm still here. I like to be able. It's funny. Yes, it seems like Pochette came, came back Pochette. for the, the trains. Oh? Thank you. Yes. Uh, yeah, I have to admit, I once uh, used a pochette <laughs> in my in my chest, but it was carnival, and it's because I I was scared to lose and to be robbed of cell phone, money, cards. That's why I use it. So you keep them just in your front, and it's easier to to manage in the crowd. <laughs> That's why I use it once. So let me see. <clears throat> Andrew, Julia, 
Can you remember any examples that you could mention? Take it here. Yes, I remember. I go to a yes. Um so um when I stay in high school, um the boys of my class just have photo in Instagram who did no shot uh your face. Uh is like he, uh, with the other uh, person uh, say it, he put in your hand in head and he just has photos uh, like this. And the, when I go to the Instagram of the people, just just have a photo like this. And the, I say, oh, I, I have an idea what your face is. And it is so strange for me. And the, for a dress, I think he, I don't like he, when people uh, do mix of colors, like she used it to red with a green, with a purple. I think this is stranger because not common, but um, in some people, uh, this stay beautiful, but I think it is uh, so difficult. Uh, you use it this uh, and they don't uh, use it the track uh, close when I do this mixture of colors. For me, it's different, uh, it's stranger, but uh, when uh, some people who work with fashion industry um, doing this, I I think, oh my God, this is so beautiful. When I try to do that, I say, oh my God, I never go to do this again. So that's it. <laughs> Got it. So you don't know why they, they, they take photos like this. I was hoping that you, as the youngest of us, would explain for us why they are taking photos like don't showing their faces. <laughs> but okay, so maybe I would Google it uh, later. <laughs> uh, yeah, for me, it doesn't make sense. If you don't want to show your face, maybe don't take a photo at all. Let, let's see. And you, Mariana. Uh, in my opinion, <laughs> uh, uh, if a relation to the fashion choice, I don't like when I saw a man use the you wearing wearing crops, tops, uh, cropped. Uh, I don't like it. <laughs> I, I eat so. I never saw one using this man. Yeah, using. I yeah yeah I saw in the Instagram, for example, João Guilherme, and the Vito. Uh, this man used cropped, and I don't like. It. I don't know. It's it's so <laughs> different for me, and I I don't like. It. Is track for me. Got it. So cropped mans. That's what uh, Mariana thinks that is tacky. And you, Marcio, in your opinion, uh, can you remember? Yeah, I remember. Yesterday, I saw uh, a car sticker, uh, which which phrase. I don't know not about this class today, but I remember what happened with me yesterday. And the and the sticker has a has a phrase: "Many follow me, but only God the company." I... <laughs> and the... what a self esteem, right? Yeah, yeah. Of yeah, the yeah, driver. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not the... I saw a guy. A skinny guy with look like hair, Wolverine. It's the same look as the Wolverine, the hairstyle. That's very strange. Oh, that's a little because, creepy. Yeah, I don't know, but I remember <laughs> this after he did this question. <laughs> yeah, you could say that it's a stacky, it, right? Because it's like it's a. Uh, um, oh, I forgot the, the expression. 
but you know it's a fictional character <laughs> so when you see in real life in the your daily routine it, it seems a little bit strange as well <laughs> but funny to see i would like to yeah, to yeah. see our the real what, life what funny, what funny. <laughs> awesome so for me yeah i would say that um fashion choices yeah i i do like bright colors using bright color colors clothes but i think that uh maybe uh, a tacky choice would be use uh some of them that doesn't combine very well with a lot of stamps as well maybe it's a would be a lot of information <laughs> so uh i can remember uh right now an example but i would say in general this one so let's keep going jump to question number let me see yeah question number four maybe marcio could start can you read for us how loud yeah. this one a moment okay uh do you believe that the techniques is subjective or are the universe elements of the tech behavior uh, I, i believe that some element is universal uh i remember the, the video that you played uh the clothes i believe this is a, a thing, universal item but another thing is maybe is a uh how say regional compartment and when i talk about the beach in brazil for example the people that use the speakers loud is common, but maybe that's the, the listen? No, I, I didn't huh? catch the, the the last thing you said. Uh, the last thing that I, I think about the beach. The beach, right. Yeah, yeah. When the, the people use the speakers. Speakers, oh, got it, oh, got it. Uh, it's common. But it's back. Yes, but yes. That that's happened only in Brazil. I don't know if it happened or not. I know. I, I believe that I see in the some videos in Colombia too. No, got it. It's common for them. Yeah. Yeah. You using them for listening to music out loud there on the beach, right? Yeah. Got it. Yeah, it's. I could say that it's tacky too, because you you like the other people. You're maybe you could bother the other people <laughs> as well. But yeah, let's hear now from let me see Julia and you. Do you mention that you think that tackiness is sub subjective? Depends on each person. But do you believe that? There are some rules of the techie behavior that are common. I is question number four, right? Uh, okay. Uh, I think he, these tracks is not is not universal because uh, one thing in Brazil is beautiful in another country these things is not beautiful. Like I see these. Asian boys like to use their makeup and the in your country uh, this is a not common we think oh men don't use makeup and the in Asia continent uh, this thing for for men is so common is uh, is one thing for girls and boys and the, I think uh, if you go to Uh, and it uh, country to Asian and the in the one man say, oh, I don't use makeup because this I not think for men. 
and this Asian style. No, uh, in here we use it. So I think these are not universal things because we have different cultures, different people. Uh, and the, these are good because we think different and the, I think this is good for your society. So that's it. Yes, yes, I loved your answer because you mentioned something about uh, the cultures, right? Different cultures. And, and maybe something that is considered techie in one is, is not in the other. And yeah, uh, that's a good thing. It would be uh, a boring word if everybody would uh, exactly the same, would be the, exactly the same, right? And so for Julia, there's no universal elements of techiness. Okay, so let's hear now from uh, Mariana and you. Yeah, it's a difficult question, but uh, I think that a person is influenced by the culture uh, where they are living. So uh, I don't know. I thought it's it's not subjective, but uh, depends where you place you live in. Here, for example, I thought is some, I saw something so common in techie, it's used, uh, I don't know how to say this in English, but they use um tennis, que é uma sandália. Uh, adults, people, kids, uh, women, men, everyone, it's a tennis, but they are open in calcanhar and uh, in, in the, 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 the side, so it's it's different, but I saw some Brazilian people use this that use this too. So if you go to Brazil using that, they are most of the people there can see this like techies, Turkey. So depends on the, the place in the culture you are living. Yes, yes. Uh, uh, you mentioned that this is a common thing uh, there in. Czech Republic. Yeah. Yeah. Can, you <laughs> can you send us a, a, maybe a link of one picture? Yeah. I'll, I'm really curious <laughs> to see. <laughs> oh, thank you. Yes, Vou yes. Aqui, aí eu mando aí você. Okay, <laughs> thanks, Mariana. And you, Rafael, what do you think? Do you agree with Marcio? I, I, I can't uh, promote my. my my speaking because I curious to imagine Mariana say about the tennis sandalia, I don't know. <laughs> but I think I am not new to say because uh, I agree with uh, Julia say is a, a fashion in a country is totally different in another country. In Brazil, uh, I have a friend uh, Rafaela is called you, you not use a lot, males not use a lot of uh, uh, pink color, you know, but in France, Italy, males use, you know, normally. Uh, Guala, Guala Via, I don't know where the name is, it's common there in the summer too. In here, we not use a lot. I, I already say, a man say Guala Via is not good for men in Brazil, and I don't say, but that's only one man, <laughs> only one guy. <laughs> <laughs> but I like it. I like it. if you make exercise is good for your your shape too. Adapt your shape. But it's it's for it's only it I have to say. <laughs> Thank you. So uh yeah, so you believe that uh, sorry, I, I didn't catch. Uh you think there are some common elements or that depends it's subjective okay. oh. sorry laura can you repeat sure sure Please. so <clears throat> i didn't catch uh what what's your point so you believe that uh, it depends 
it, it depends on each culture, right? It's not something yeah. universal. Yeah. Got it. Yeah. Right. Yes, yes, just confirm. Got it. So, uh, I believe, in my opinion, let me see. Yeah, I do believe that, <clears throat> in general, it's subject. But uh, I don't know if you guys remember on the video, they don't only mention about uh, fashion uh, choices, right? And the clothes that they are using. They mentioned some behaviors like, oh, being <clears throat> petty pincher, like I will go out with you, but I would make you pay for everything. And, uh, you know, always remember a person, a favor that you did. But I believe that like, I have experienced some uh, a specific a specific tech behavior that I believe that it's universal universal like uh telling a joke in a funeral <laughs> it's not appropriated but yeah some people do it they think that they are like helping but it's not exactly the moment so it's a little bit of nonsense as well <laughs> like <clears throat> I believe that I, I consider a tech behavior and I believe that this uh, thing, specifically in this situation, it, it would be like universal. In, no matter the culture you would uh, be inserted, you wouldn't, wouldn't tell this, uh, do this, telling a joke in a funeral. But yeah, that's my, my opinion. Let's see. We still have some time. Uh, um, yeah, uh, maybe we can go to question, question number seven about social media. Uh, maybe we could start with Julia. Yes. Uh, so, I think the social media is good and bad in the same time. I think these things about fashion um, is not good because um, this is what is beautiful and what is not. And I think you need to use uh, things which is beautiful to you. Like... Uh, I think he, uh, we need to use it, things which is beautiful for you, and they don't stay to think, oh, this is track or not. And I think the social medias um, show many things uh, is good for you uh, buy, like beautiful clothes, beautiful things, but the most of things, these things, uh, these clothes are so expensive to many people and I think this is not good because we start to to look for people in social media and, and think so I need to buy these things I need to buy these clothes I need to to be like these girls and the this is not good for your mental health and the uh, I think he, when social media uh, said this for all people like, oh, you don't can you cannot use these clothes. You cannot do that. You cannot uh, be this person. I think this is uh, not good for a uh, personality for many people. So, like, I can use uh, these clothes because uh, most people say this is uh, not beautiful. Most people say uh, this is track, and the I think this is uh, not good for uh personal for uh, for the world because the most important is about your uh, your health and the why uh, is beautiful to you and the i think it's good you uh, you consume these contents but i think you need to stop when this is not good for your mental health 
Yes, yes, I agree with you 100%, Julia. Uh, unfortunately, in social media, we compare ourselves a lot, right, with the others. And it's not uh, the healthiest behavior. We, we must know to learn how to, to manage these things. But let's hear now, let me see from Marcio. And you, Marshall, what's your opinion about? <clears throat> so, uh, social media, I believe they drive some of the behavior. Uh, at some time, uh, how people that they, they follow this, I don't know, I say advices or suggestions, uh, lose your identity. It's strange for me because you can be you, no another people. <laughs> what happened with the social media? <laughs> yes, yes, that's true, Martin. You, when you say about losing your identity, because you, you wanna, you know, fit in, in some group, right? To be accepted. That, yeah, that's yeah. complicated, right? Uh, we still have some time, maybe, uh, Rafael, in you, what, what do you think about it? I really don't have a, <clears throat> a good opinion about it because I don't use social media a lot. But I think they, they say that they like uh, when a teenager I am more affected about the the artists. Like uh, I don't know, I said before when I teenager I repeat the style of the Charlie Brown Jr. Another artist. I have my face of him or two. Now I don't know what the social media can say to you use, but. They, if they use a follow Neymar profile, you know, can use the stray quotes Neymar use you another another people, another famous people. It's for me, it's good in, good for Neymar because they can can sell the marks they use and, and get my money <laughs> and that's for you. If you don't like this style, you know. If you only say follow me, ma, or another be another 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 person. I say in the Korea in China, uh, because uh, we saw the competitions of uh, of the uh, online games, uh, online games there. They use the like the same codes because they in South Korea they have a uh, uh, BTS, they like this boy band. I don't know, I don't know the name. They use the codes. Uh, Similar in the the boys and the girls is like this. I shine I don't know, but this code that is the Asia, they have uh, influence. But in Brazil, we also say I know in social media, no, I don't see any examples of you know <laughs> I don't use it a lot because uh, it spends off my time. Yeah. Okay, okay. Oh, no, I, I got it. But yeah, you said something that that's true. Usually younger people like teenagers tend to to be more influenced by by these trends, right? Like when you say about people that the the young boys that follow uh, Neymar's Neymar's profile and watch and see all the time that things that they are he's using it or not, Mar um, um, brands that they are he, he's promoting right and try to follow them, follow him right. Um, that's true. And you, Mariana, you didn't answer yet, right? Yes, but uh, 
I totally agree with Julia. And uh, I thought I don't have anything to add because you need to use the things we make us uh, feel good. And uh, we need to think in our mental health. So we need to stop to be influenced for, for this social media. Uh, to, you need to stop to adapt ourselves for the older people. I don't know if you understand, but a gente tem que parar de ficar se enquadrando o que as outras pessoas querem. Aí sim, o que a gente gosta. Né? Yes, yes, you're totally right, Mariana. Because uh, we are not here to please anyone, right? Just to be happy, right? That's the, the main point. I agree with you. Hey, guys, let's welcome the guys back from the... the breakout room how was the conversation let me see wow thing what do you, what do you think of the conversation is is good is a a very funny team is is very good for me yeah it's funny but it's complex right yeah. Yeah. <laughs> at the same time but uh i was let me ask you a question. Um, have you ever, uh, question number five, I don't know if you guys have already discussed it, this one in the room. Have you ever accidentally done something tacky and regret it later? Can you remember? I don't know. Maybe when you were younger. It's true. Can you, yeah. Can you yeah. remember? Never. Never? I, I, I something text sometimes, but I never regret this. I oh. Really like, I really like being at tech event sometimes. Yes, yes. I don't have problem with it. Oh, that, that's important, right? Be confident about uh, you, what you like. We are we're discussing this, this importance, right? Try not um to like uh, mimic all the time the others be authentic and not to compare so much that's important that's healthy <laughs> uh, uh thank uh, thank you Walsing. let me see thank you. uh let me ask uh victoria uh about question number 10 I don't know uh, if you guys have reached this one, but uh, this is uh, like, I, I know that is a, co a complex theme, but I, I would like to know your opinion about question number 10. Victoria, in your opinion, who are more taken, poor people or rich people? Usually. Victoria, <laughs> I believe that she is not listening. So <laughs> let me ask you, oh, Maria, uh, question number nine. Uh, do you think that uh, thankiness can be considered a positive trait or um, always is a negative one? What do you think? Um... I don't know, depending on the point of view of the person that is saying the song is so is seeing this. For example, for me, I don't I don't doesn't matter a lot if a person is striker or not. I don't care a lot about this. Uh, I don't think that could be even positive or even I got even the advance of the person and the point of view about where the track. So for me, either Okay, oh, okay. <laughs> that you have no problem with this. Okay. So guys, uh let me just put some links on the the, the chat because unfortunately our time is almost over. 
I didn't, I couldn't put us live on YouTube right now, <clears throat> but I'm, I'm putting us later because I, <clears throat> I am recording it. But the first link that is important, okay, is uh, the link of the survey. It's really important <clears throat> for us if you guys um, answer this one. Don't worry, it's anonymous. You can put uh, the things that you guys believe that I can be better uh, as a host. And also uh, share uh, some topics that you are interested to discuss in the future. I will, would really love to hear what you guys are interested to. And the second one is for TNT's website. So you can, guys, can go there, check the our plans and so on. So um, I believe that's it. Thank you so much for coming, everybody. Have a great rest of the week and yeah. a great day. Bye-bye. 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 Thank you. Bye. Bye.